Good morning everybody, how are you? So nice to see you, love vlogging, absolutely love it. So I'm so excited to be spending the day with you guys today. It is currently Sunday and I am just in such a good mood. The sun is shining, it is officially the first day of spring and I could not be happier about it. So today's video, I just thought I'd pick up the camera and do a vlog. I just, as I said, I love vlogging. And I thought that I could show you guys what I'm up to today. Yesterday, I actually had a really exciting delivery from Ana Luisa, who is the kind sponsor of today's video. You guys know that I have worked with Ana Luisa for ages now and I absolutely love their products. I have so many from them and I just love them. I really support this brand. Um, so yeah, yesterday I had a really nice delivery from them. Really exciting. I actually got this beautiful necklace which I am obsessed with. I love it so much. It's got like a moon around the edge and then on the inside like this little circle bit here is an opal and I just love anything to do with like crystals the moon stars like astrology i love anything to do with that you guys know i'm so into like the law of attraction and stuff so i just couldn't resist getting this necklace it is beautiful and then i got this ring which is so stunning it is a really thin dainty band with little gems across it and it's just so nice and as I said like really dainty so I am just so excited about these and they're just beautiful one thing I love about Ana Luisa is that they produce really high quality pieces of jewellery for really affordable prices they start at like $39 which is so good and they're also 100% carbon neutral so they offset 100% of their carbon emissions so it's really good for the environment too and their packaging is really sweet um my mum, as you guys know, it's Mother's Day coming up in the UK. Um, I'm not sure about the dates for other countries, but ours is on the 27th of March. And I'm making my mum a little um, pamper, I nearly said hamper pamper, pamper hamper, um, which I think is going to be really nice. I love to do something thoughtful for my mum on Mother's Day, so that's what I'm going to do. I do tend to do a hamper. I think I have done one for like three years now but the one that i'm going to make her this year is kind of based around crystals my mum also really loves crystals like me and i picked her up this gorgeous necklace from Ana luisa so this is the necklace it also does have opal in it that's what the shiny bit is here and it is just so beautiful i really really love this so I'm really hoping that she likes this too. It is just so beautiful. And as I said, I love Ana Luisa. I've also gifted um, some items from Ana Luisa for like Christmas presents to my mum and my sister and they have both really liked them. I think it's so important to kind of appreciate someone that you love and try and get them things that you know that they'll like so yeah i really hope that she likes that and i'm so excited to be doing the hamper so i am actually going to do that with you guys now because mother's day is next week it's literally a week today and i haven't done a single thing i've bought everything but i just haven't presented it nicely i'm also making her a little photo book which I think it's going to be really cute. I've printed off loads of photos of me and my mum throughout the years and I'm just making like a little scrapbook. Um, I've also picked her up a candle and a room spray that are um, like infused with crystals. So the room spray has crystals at the bottom and the candle has crystals in the candle. And I've also bought her a Moroccan geode quartz, which I hope that she likes because she actually bought me my one a couple of years ago now for Christmas and she really liked it. So I've bought her one herself. So I'm really hoping that she likes that so as i said i'm gonna do that with you guys today while i've got some time so i really hope that you guys enjoy spending the day with me and whatever we get up to i do need to pop to primark in a little bit because i need to return some jeans that did not fit um and it's literally a day after i'm allowed to return them so i'm really hoping they let me return them 
I've left it a little bit late, I know. So yeah, we're gonna have a really nice day together. I'm not sure whether I'll vlog today and tomorrow or just today, we'll just kind of see how we get on. But yeah, thank you so much to Ana Luisa for sponsoring today's video. If you guys do wanna check out Ana Luisa, I'll leave all of the links in the description box below. I really recommend having a look on their website. You will find some really beautiful, unique pieces of jewelry. They are just stunning. And they are currently running their Mother's Day sale. So definitely click the link below because it will direct you straight to the website and you can have a look at all of their sale items so let's get on and make this hamper i'm so excited so these are the bits that i've picked up for my mum um let's just move the scissors out the way so this is the hamper here that i'm going to put everything in and these are the presents. So this is the little scrapbook that I've picked up. It is from Hobbycraft and I think it was about five pounds, which is actually really good. And there are loads of pages. And then obviously I've printed off some photos here, which I'm gonna cut out. I have already cut out quite a few that are just in the book, um, but I need to glue them down. Obviously I've got my Ana Luisa necklace that I'm gonna put in there. And these are the items from HomeSense. So this is the room spray. It's by Liththerapy, Liththerapy, Wick and Vessel. And it's a room fragrance and it's coconut nectar infused with rose quartz, which honestly sounded incredible and I was so tempted to pick up one myself. <laughs> So yeah, that is her first crystal infused present. I then got a candle, which is also from HomeSense and it is the Purity Lab Crystal Healing Candle. It's rose quartz and it's the scent Rose Hip and Jasmine, which smells amazing. This is what it looks like in the candle. So you've got the rose quartz pieces. And I just thought that she would really love this because she loves candles and she likes anything rose quartz. And it also just smells amazing. I can smell it from here. And then this is the crystal that I have picked her up. Oh my gosh, look how sparkly it is. In the sunlight, this honestly looks incredible. Um, so yeah, it's just a Moroccan geode quartz. And you can stand it up as well because of the shape of it. It's quite cool. So yeah, it just stands up like that. And I think it's so pretty. Over here, I've got my mum's card, which I got from Hallmark. It's a really beautiful Mother's Day card. And then I've also got this, which is the wrapping for the hamper. I also got this from Hallmark, bless them. They were so helpful in there. And yeah, they really helped me pick out some nice stuff. So I'm gonna get on and start making everything um, i'm just so excited i get so excited about making people presents does anyone else get like this because i think that i actually prefer giving presents to receiving them i just love i love seeing people's faces when they open presents from me i'm gonna let the sun shine in the day Trying to make this darkness go away Fulfill my wish. wish Make me feel good Make me feel nice Just singing into a uh, <laughs> piece of Cadbury's chocolate orange mm -mm -mm. I've never heard someone call it a Cadbury's chocolate orange It's Terry's It is Terry's isn't it What am I on about? So I'm currently taking a break from the hamper because we're going to Primark to take back my jeans before it shuts. So let's get a move on. Look at that sunshine. Am I the sunshine? Are you on about the sunshine? I was talking about me. You're the dark side of the moon. <laughs> Charming. <laughs> we just got into town, guys. Um, this lighting is not good. Um, so yeah, we're just popping into Primark so that I can take back my jeans and then I'm going to Taco Bell. What? Yes, I am. I'm going to Taco Bell. Woohoo! We found out yesterday, or was it the day before, that there was a Taco Bell in the town that we always go to. And I didn't know about that. So we're going to go to Taco Bell because I, ever since we got back from Manchester, I've been craving it. I just love it so much. So that's what we're doing. I'm 
gonna let the past be filled with smoke And I will try to fix what has been broken And take this way out of my Taco Bell, shoulders. guys! Oh, I can smell it. I can smell the chips. We're currently on our way now to the retail park because Callum didn't want a Taco Bell. He wants a KFC. So we're going to go to the retail park that has a KFC. And then I think we're going to pop into either Dunelm or the range because we're trying to look for some new coasters for the house. So yeah, that's the plan. I can't wait to eat. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten lunch. And it's currently 20 past three. So oh, lunch, yeah, I'm so hungry now. And I can just smell. It's quite early as well. Huh? I've made breakfast at like nine o'clock. Yeah. Four past nine. We got up fairly early actually. Well, you did, not me. I cleaned the house before you got up. Yeah. We had a bit of a late night last night. We went out with a couple of our friends. And... Uh, yeah, I wasn't hungover or anything. I just, we went to sleep so late. It was like two o'clock, wasn't it? And I was just tired. I, I cleaned the house before you got up. Yeah, I did hear you get up and I was like, I, I ain't getting wake, up. I always wake up early after I drink though, don't yeah. I? Yeah. I could never get settled. We did have a really good night though. It was good. Oh, I'm so full now, guys. That was so good. It's taken all my lipstick off. Ugh. Why can't I speak? It's taken all my lipstick off. Remember the other day when I couldn't speak? Yeah, literally Callum the other day. What was wrong? Were we in Manchester? Mm. Callum just couldn't speak. Like, he, you kept trying to say stuff and it would just come out as something else. What was wrong with me? <laughs> it was so funny. Um, but yeah, my order for Taco Bell, if you guys don't, like, have never been to Taco Bell before because I hadn't before Manchester and then I had it every day that we were there for lunch and it was just so good and I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. Um, but I get the Crunch Wrap Supreme with beef. You have tried the chicken though. Yeah, I did try the chicken in Manchester. So one day I had the chicken one and then the second day I had the beef and then I decided that I liked the beef the best because it's not as dry. I found the chicken one a little bit dry, um, but oh my gosh, the beef one is just so good. And then the chips, Mm. The chips are on a different level. If you haven't tried Taco Bell chips, They're you are good. missing out. They are so good. Callum just stole so many of mine on the I way I'm here. I'm not like a massive fan of chips, am I? But I can't eat them, but I don't. They are unreal. They are so good. And I don't know what it is about them that makes them so good. It's like the seasoning on them. I don't know what it is. Mm. It's just unbelievable. Um, so, yeah, if you are local, they now have a Taco Bell in Cheltenham. So that's where we just went. And I'm not sure when it opened. I'm guessing it opened fairly recently. Mind you, though, I have already found better chips. Then I, I I'm can guarantee you, I'm that they're not better. Now, German Donner Kebab chips. Oh. What, in Cheltenham? Mm, good. You said they were spicy, though. Mm. I don't like spicy. Oh, no, I do. Mm. So, yeah, that was my order. The um, I got it in a meal, so you get the chips with it. Today I got a large because I was being a pig, but it was so good. And then we got a uh, tango. I got a tango as well. Did you? Mm. Mm. So Callum's just got his KFC. He's got a bonus banquet. And a burger. Someone's car is so loud. I keep. I think there's someone in the drive through I swear I saw like an Audi R8 or something. So yeah, we're just waiting for Callum to finish his meal. And then behind us is the range and Dunham. Which one do you think that we should go into? Try both. See what they are. Let's go into the range first. I like the range. I might show you guys around the range a little bit. See if they've got any summer stuff. Did you know today's the first day of spring? The first official day of spring. Spring has sprung. Spring has sprung. It has begun. <laughs> Time of year. Hmm. I do like That's spring. Where all the fun begins. You guys got any plans for spring, summer? Let us know. I love to know what people are getting up to. I'm so nosy. Yeah, you're a nosy neighbour as well. I am a nosy neighbour. Mm, I'm gonna let the past stay in the cold. I'll move the sun to the ocean. Let its unsaid words be spoken. Let my mind be carried by the waves Oh, I will open up my eyes so I can see the light Oh, and I'll try to spread my wings so I can fly Oh, and the darkness starts to fade Feels like things are gonna go away <laughs> He said, 
<laughs> Hello. <laughs> what are you saying? No pups. Oh, you think you're famous? <laughs> They've got some really nice, cute little Easter bits in, guys. Look at that. That's really cute. And I like these. Little candle holders, tea light holders. Hold the weapon. Hold my weapon. What's he doing? <laughs> I was going to do it then. Are you going to pay for it if you break it? No. There you go. <laughs> I'm going to let the sun shine in the day. You'll never guess what he did, guys. <laughs> so. I was just looking around, filming everything for you, and I said, oh, what time does it shut? Because it's Sunday and it's 10 to four. And I went, is it four o'clock? And he went, I don't know, I'll have a look. He said to me, yeah, it's four, you better hurry up. And I knew he was lying, I just, I had a feeling, so I Googled it and it's half past four. You, see, look, if you ever don't get good content, blame him, rushing me. I do like those. I do like them. I like those as well. Pretty. Yeah, I like those. These? Yeah. Where's he off to? He's on a mission. Double check. What are you going all close up for? You were walking towards me. Vogue. Vogue? <laughs> Yeah, I like those. They'll match the um, tray on the coffee table as well. Yeah. I do like them. How much are they? £6.49. Yeah, I'm only willing to pay six quid. <laughs> about 49p? <laughs> £6.49. Not paying the 49 I'll stand at the tell of bar with them. <laughs> Can I go back to filming what I was filming before you tried to trick me and say that it shut half an hour earlier? Yeah, but we have got to go to the Nam as well. Do we? Well, do you want those or do you want to check in there as well? I don't know. I mean, we can always go there after and return these. Yeah, true. But I do like them. Nice, aren't they? Yeah. Let's get these. Okay. On with looking around the shops. Oh my god. What? When did you make it famous? <laughs> You're so mean to me. <laughs> He's been calling me pig for the past like. No, we call each other pig. Yeah, we do. Got a curly tail. Where are you going, piggy? <laughs> Shut up. I'm taking you on a bear hunt. Bear hunt? Yeah. Going on a bear hunt. Going to catch a big one. What a beautiful guy. For a whole 1,249.99, you can get this. <laughs> What? It's nice. Welcome to our garden. Where are you going? They're not cool enough. <laughs> Do you want to play hide and seek? No. <laughs> Do you want to? <laughs> no. Play hide and seek with me. Right, I've well, got a real good place. Let me hide there. No, I'm hiding first. Uh, you got Callum's told me to give him 30 seconds <laughs> to hide. So I'm just looking at the uh, living room furniture. That looks similar to our bed, but it's silver. I'm gonna go try and find him early. Where do we think he is? What is he doing? <laughs> Can you spot him? What are you doing? It's not really hide and seek if you if you show yourself. I can yeah. I think they're really cute actually. I could see them literally over this bit, so it's not really hide and seek if you just pop up. Yeah, it's nice. That you're rubbish at hide and seek. Yeah, but you wouldn't find me if I tried. I would. I'm going to go down here and look at all of the nice little decor bits. Stop calling me pig. I like that. That's nice. Oh, and that little basket down there. That's cute. 
I want to go have a look at all the little bits and bobs. Always believe something wonderful. Wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> wonderful? <laughs> Always believe something wonderful is about to happen. Where's to live by? To the left. To the left. <laughs> That's our one unexpected purchase for the day. I feel like every day is a new thing for the house. Are you going to show them what we got? No. <laughs> I need a blanket out there. Nice little blanket. A new one for the sofa. Only 12 quid. What a bargain. Oh, nearly hit me with the door. Show and tell. <laughs> it is really nice though. So we've got our coasters and we've got the blanket that we didn't actually go in for, but Callum actually saw it. I picked the coasters as well. You did, yeah. I'm so, just, just feeling a bit, bit uh, inspired today, you know. Callum just wanted to buy some home bits, clearly. So yeah, we're currently on our way home now after having some nice food and spending a little bit of money which seems to be our favourite thing at the moment. Oh, the seat belt. And then, what are we doing when we get home? Huh? What, what are we doing when we get home? Um, I don't know, I might go for a walk. Oh, really? Watch the sunset, you know. Oh, I thought you were going to say you are going to watch the F1. No, I'll watch it on highlights later. I need to still finish um, Mum's hamper. I want to watch that Tinder Swindler. Yeah, we're going to watch Tinder Swindler because um, the friends that we went out with last night said that they watched it and they said it was really good. So we're going to watch that. I think it's about an hour and a half. So we'll be doing that this evening. Do you want to go for a walk? Yeah, we can go for a walk. On the river? Watch the sunset? Yeah, why not? It's a shame Carousel won't be open. <laughs> There's a place near us called Carousel and it does the most amazing cakes and uh, like drinks and stuff and we literally go there so much. Every time we go for a walk. <laughs> I haven't really had a lot of cake from there recently for obvious reasons but oh lighting just went really flipping dark. Um, so yeah. Uh, I have a brownie every time. Callum literally has, Callum has so many brownies from there because he loves them. Oh, that sun is bright, isn't it, everybody? Yeah, it won't be open now because it's Sunday. a Sunday and it'll be shut early. We live in like a town that's quite old, full of quite elderly people. There are young people, but quite a lot of older people. And yeah, it's just not like the city, is it? Can't really compare it to Manchester. Full stop. Can't believe I live in your thoughts. About you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful delight. Forgo, give up everything that I own. Yeah, I'd give it all up now just to be with you somehow. Unexpected love was found. rose in a garden and it shows if I'm honest you're the leaves in mid -August. Hello everybody, it's now a little bit later on in the day, quite a bit later actually, it's now the evening um, obviously the last thing that you saw would have been putting the blanket on the sofa and the new coasters so we've obviously put those out since then I've done a little bit more on the scrapbook for my mum and um, I actually popped round to their house because she is currently not there so I went and got some more photos um, and I've taken photos of photos on my phone and I'm going to print them out um, and I'm probably going to end up finishing that tomorrow morning so I'll probably show you what it looks like tomorrow but I really fancy a nice relaxing bubble bath this evening. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just go and run one and I'm gonna take my makeup off because this makeup has just been on my face for far too long. So I'm gonna go and run a bath, use all of my nice stuff. Um, so like my bath salts, my bath milk, um, which is like my, I think it's called, what is it called? 
I can't remember what it's called, but I'll show you what I use. It is honestly so nice and it gets you so ready for bed. Um, and then this evening I'm going to do a little bit of journaling. I have neglected it a lot and I really want to get back into it. Um, I just kind of do it every now and again at the moment. And there was one point where I was so, like, not strict on it, but I was so... I was enjoying it so I was doing it every single day so I want to get back into that because it really does make a difference to your mindset and I just feel like we're going into April we're in spring and I really need to get cracking if I want this to be the best year of my life which I know it will be if I put in the work so I'm going to do that this evening. I need to scrub off my tan because it is honestly not a vibe at the moment. And then I might refake tan tonight or tomorrow. It is half past nine right now. So it is actually quite late for me. So I probably will end up doing it tomorrow. So yeah, I'm going to go run a bath and have a nice relaxing bath and probably do a little bit of reading. everybody it is now the next day and excuse my appearance i have obviously not long woken up and i just thought i didn't show you the hamper so i've literally just finished it i have wrapped it up and put the bow on so now it's all good to go so yeah i'm really happy with it i'll just show you quickly what it looks like so this is what it looks like i've got the nice cute little pink bow on there all of the presents are inside there the cards in there um so yeah the the book turned out really well there's quite a lot of photos in there and i'm just so happy with how it's turned out because i love doing hampers and i just think it looks really cute so i really hope that she likes it so i think that's going to go ahead and conclude today's video guys i really hope that you've enjoyed watching this little vlog if you did don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe to my channel if you're new thank you again so much to anna louisa for sponsoring today's video don't forget to look at the description box for the link if you do want to check out anna louisa i really highly recommend and you will not be disappointed with the mother's day sale so yeah thanks again to anna louisa i hope you guys have had an amazing week so far and i'll see you in the next video on sunday Bye.